Hello, my lovelies. So, um, this is the Savior's channel that I am, I found this off of. I have no idea what this is, you guys, but it came to me, and this is the Upchurch UFO sighting. If you guys saw this, I'm sorry. Um, I have something uploading very soon. It has to do with all of your comments regarding Wild Bill's music, his diss and stuff. So I'm reading you guys' comments again. I freaking literally have a headache from laughing so hard. It's amazing. So let's see what uh, Boss is doing over here. Upchurch UFO sighting, huh? Hello everyone and welcome to Channel 69 News with Redneck Nation TV. Tonight we are in Cheatham County at the Ashton City Walmart because a man said that he's seen a UFO just over the hill. For those of you who know, that Wild Bill likes to tell me I'm a stalker. I'm probably there stalking now. Just so you guys know. Sorry. You guys will have to see the other videos. You know what I'm talking about. Hills over there. And what we're about to do is we're going to interview this man and ask him about his experience. What seemed like a normal night for young Greg Baker at this Ashton City Walmart in Middle Tennessee wasn't so normal. After he came outside and hit his kneecap on the fire hydrant, he noticed ahead up in the woods a weird shaped flying saucer as he speaks. We're here to talk to him about it now because this <laughs> may change his life forever. My name's Greg Baker and I really did see a motherfucking UFO, man. I might come down here at Walmart about what time is it? My phone's dead. Uh, about 3 o'clock in the morning, I was craving boiled eggs and just got done smoking fucking two joints, two joints. And I come down here and I see it up in the woods and I was like, what is that? Oh, it's like, I know who that was. That's probably a fucking old Jimbo down the street spotlighting deer. Hope the sheriff don't find him. Then I remembered I had my mag light in my truck. I bought out a full drive magazine. I shot. Is this him now or is this him like years ago? I can't tell. I don't know. He doesn't have to tell me. It hurts. It hurts. You guys made me laugh too much. I ended up there, you'll never guess what I saw, man. It was a freak ass fucking creature looking at me all with bug eyed, man. I thought it was a fucking big ass frog. You know, I thought it done went there to Cumberland and drank that chemical water. Jump the fucking cigarette. I was just Get, drank that, that chemical water there. and blowed up off steroids or something. Some bitch start running down the hill. That maglite don't lie, it's like fucking 500 volts inside of it. What? This maglite, okay, one time. <laughs> this maglite is so powerful. One time, the maglite don't lie, because I. That some bitch got like 500 volts in it. Look, one time my brother's fucking Isuzu rodeo broke down down there by coming there. We jump started that motherfucker with that mag light, dude. And down the hill, oh, <laughs> I thought it was a part of ISIS. So I have this mag light in my hand. This little creature comes running down the thing. I thought it was a, a, a frog, like I told you before. He touches mag. <laughs> I don't know if I can keep up with that kind of energy ever. <laughs> And the fucking bulb busted. You know he's from the you know he's from space now. Hey look, y'all, if y'all don't believe me, I got <laughs> evidence, okay? I was I running swear. away from him and he dropped one of his testicles. I'm gonna show it to you. Look. This ain't your everyday ordinary kid ball, okay? This is a fucking testicle with a bunch of nipples all over it. I'm fucking kidding with you or something. Look at this fucking thing. Lucky he didn't make hand-to-hand -hand combat with me, because I've seen Roadhouse like 45 times. I will karate chop you in the fucking dick. And you know, aliens, they say come in all shapes and sizes. They said George Bush is an alien, but I kind of believe it. I've seen that shit on Discovery Channel. You know, they, I feel like I've been having somebody follow me the past five years, probably because my IQ, because, you know, aliens tend to follow, like, real smart people. And if you got a real smart brain inside of you, they'll come steal it from you. When I was in kindergarten, I passed the spelling bee. I passed every single word, made my GPA a 58.5. I've memorized every single truck Ford's ever made with my own two hands. See, the only reason that alien didn't fuck with me is because I drive a Ford. If you drive a Chevy, he gonna stick your finger up your ass. If anybody else has been out at 3 o'clock in the morning at Walmart for no apparent reason because you're drunk and just... Okay, so I see. This is when he was just a real youngin' then. So maybe four or five years ago. I getcha, I getcha. So you guys just published this recently so everyone can see this. Got it. Yeah, he looks the same. I was just like, is this from last week or? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Mm, I'm so glad he does not pay attention. Just got done bow fishing. Please call 1-800-I-SAW-THAT-SHIT. 
or report it to your local police department. Thank y'all for watching Redneck Nation News with Channel 69. We'll see y'all next week. Yeah, he, okay, I get it now. He's a little bit older. Hello! Nope. Okay. Shout out to the Saviors. They published this June 6th. So now you guys know. Alright. Let's see what's next, guys. I gotta go take something. My head hurts from laughing so hard.